Hey, we have the baby. Fort Worth police releasing body cam video of an officer rescuing a baby who'd been kidnapped, then abandoned by the suspect. A woman told cops an unknown man stole her car right out of her driveway with her six-month-old inside. Officers tracked down the car and arrested Elliot Rias, but no sign of the baby. Then, about five minutes later... Ah, oh, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Police found the baby in his car seat in a ravine. He was checked out by medics and returned to his mom. Wild weather in the Houston area. Storms pushed through Harris and Galveston counties Tuesday, flooding streets and several cities. Lightning from those storms even sparking this house fire at a home in Dickinson. Three firefighters were taken to the hospital for smoke inhalation. Meanwhile, wind knocked down trees and floodwaters stranded drivers and filled drains. DFW Development, Dallas-Fort Worth International Airport announced this week it is adding a long-awaited sixth terminal as part of a massive renovation. Terminal F will be built over the next few years. The $1.6 billion project will add 15 new gates to the airport during its first phase, along with state-of-the-art facilities. It's set to be done in 2026. And finally, high honors. A Houston police officer was among nine people to receive the Medal of Valor from President Biden Wednesday. Sergeant Kendrick Simpo was selected for tackling a suspect carrying a rifle and 120 rounds of ammo within a few feet of hundreds of children. This happened last February at the Galleria. The Medal of Valor is the highest honor for bravery by a public safety officer. John Krinjak, Fox 7 Austin News.